The procedure is performed for chronic intractable abdominal pain caused by pancreatitis, pancreatic cancer, abdominal cancer, and abdominal metastatic cancer. Celiac plexus. Anatomical nervous system is one of the peripheral nervous systems. Celiac plexus is sympathetic system of autonomic nervous system. The celiac plexus is also known as the solar plexus. Celiac plexus located between 12 thoracic vertebrae and L1 lumbar vertebrae surrounded by the aorta. Plexus is formed by the nerve fiber from vagus nerve, greater splanconic nerve, and lesser sprankolic nerve. The celiac plexus includes a number of smaller plexuses such as hepatic plexus, nerve from the liver, clinic plexus, nerve from the spleen, gastric plexus, nerves to stomach, pancreatic plexus, nerves to pancreas, suprarenal plexus, nerves to adrenaline gland, renal plexus, nerves to kidneys, testicular and ovarian plexus, nerves to testicle and ovary, superior mesenteric plexus, nerves to duodenum and small intestine, inferior mesenteric plexus, nerves to large colon, cecum and in, and in. Sympathetic nerve fibers from celiac plexus innervate pancreas, gallbladder, liver, stomach, spleen, kidneys, small and large intestine, adrenaline gland, and blood vessels. Celiac plexus lie behind and in front of aorta. Celiac plexus lie catered to thoracic vertebra. T12 and lumbar vertebra L1. Patient is brought in the operating room for the procedure. Patient is advised to lie in position with pillow under the abdomen. Patient is sedated with intravenous sedation necessary. Skin and subcutaneous tissue is anesthetized local anesthesia. Local anesthesia used is lidocaine 1%. Lidocaine is injected using 23 gauge needles. Total volume is about 2 to 3 cc. Procedure is performed using image intensifier, which is portable tray machine. Anterior posterior, lateral, and oblique use for needle placement. Live intermittent continuous exposure pictures are viewed during the procedure. Needle is placed under the anesthesia in front of air. Two needles are placed on each side, right and left. X-ray, anterior, posterior, and lateral view is used for placement of the needle over the celiac plexus. Aspiration test is performed to check aspiration of blood. Dye study is done. Dye study will indicate a spread of linear fascia, cephalic, and caudal direction on the both the sides. Anterior posterior view and lateral side view is checked to confirm the dye spread. Select plexus block. After the placement of the needle, aspiration test is performed to check needle placement if located within the blood vessel. Medication detected at each side when all the tests are indicating needle is not in the blood vessel and the placement is where it's supposed to be. 20 cc of 0.5% marquee injected on each side. Needle gently removed. Patient is observed in the recovery room for any complication and patient is discharged home with advice to lie down for 24 hours and if there is any complaint such as if patient with dizziness or weakness, patient should immediately go to the ER just to rule out there is any bleeding from the aorta. Thanks for the watching presentation by www.epenuses.com. Thank you.